ESL Challenger Katowice właśnie się rozpoczął, a ze mną jest zawodnik drużyny Ecstatic Manx. Hello, Marcus. Hello. Nice to meet you, uh, Marcus. Uh, Hey, you have been in Ecstatic since November 2021. Players come and go, but you are still here. Could you tell me about the current lineup in the context of the past rosters? Yeah. Um, so, uh, yes, I've been here for a long time. Uh, I enjoy being a part of the organization and also the rosters I've been part of. Um, I would say our previous roster, the international roster with uh, Bear from Sky, Fasha, Dafu, and Wolfie slash Cello was uh, a little bit different from this one because I think uh, we had more experience on that team um, and we had played together for a very long time at that point, like towards the end. But uh, with this new roster, I have uh, a lot of young and hungry players. I transitioned into IGL, so I'm also developing. And uh, yeah, we also Danish, so a bit more comfortable uh, with the communication. But uh, overall, I'm pretty happy with this roster right now. And yeah. Yeah, Forza was a tough rival. How did the match look like from your perspective? So we uh, played Forza, yeah, we are kind of rivals at this point. We played them uh, a lot and uh, it's a big back and forward. I would say that they have the upper hand most of the time. I think they're a really good team and I think they are really strong against us. Um, I think uh, we played really pretty well this match, but when we got on the T side, we could not find the momentum. We didn't win a pistol round, and we lost all the important clutch rounds. So yeah, that's it. Yeah, you are in a group B. That's a kind of tough group. Only two teams can advance. Uh, what uh, and you will play against uh, Pain or Nine Z? Uh, what rival would you rather pick? Um, I. I I don't have any preference towards those two teams because they're both uh, South American and I think they're both pretty good teams. Uh, we knew this group would be hard, so we see every opponent as 50-50. We have to win clutches, we have to be on point, have to play our game. And I think uh, hopefully this was a little bit of a wake-up call and we're just gonna go full power into the next match. Yeah, uh, you've placed uh, third, fourth uh, on uh, ESL Melbourne, and uh, right now we are in Katowice. What are your expectations for this time tournament? Uh, I think I want to, we we as a team want to go out of groups. We know this is a very hard group, but that's kind of our expectations. Going to playoffs, everything can happen. But I think uh, we have a lot of 50-50 matches in this group, and I think we need to be able to win like in even matches. Yeah, this is the, one of the last tournaments in Counter-Strike. Counter-Strike 2 is coming. So I have a question. Do you have access to limited beta? Yeah, I have access to the beta. I don't play it a lot. I only play those two. Uh, I only focus on CSGO right now and I want to like do what we can in CSGO. So, yeah. How do you view the new version of CS as a pro player? I'm very excited. I think, uh, first of all, the visuals are very good, but also a new competitive edge with the smokes and uh, with the loadout and everything like that. I think it's uh, pretty nice. So, and also when we, and like on new maps, I think I've been on teams that are pretty good. So I think we can be good in CS2. And the last question, do you want to say something to your supporters? Yeah, I want to say thank you for everyone who is supporting and also everyone who follow, uh, supports me personally. And yeah, it's just, it's very nice, also, both in good and bad times. Yeah, thank you so much and best of luck. Thank you.